What's going down, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Campbell and Coleman. It's your boy Josh, aka Coleman, and uh, today is a good day. Today is a good day. Just like yesterday, it's a good day. Today, we're going to unbox that box that I got from A Man Hobbies. I am super stoked. If you didn't see uh, when I got the box that's on the last episode, go check it out and you will see the big announcement that I made. Pretty stoked right now. But for those of you that did watch that video, you already know what this is about, so let's get into it. I think we got a box to rip open. Boom! Look at that. It's not just a box. It's actually, it's a really big box with a little bit of damage. A little bit of damage here, but I don't think it's enough to actually hurt anything. Um, it's kind of heavy. Really, it's kind of heavy. Uh, and it comes from Amen Hobbies. So, let's go ahead and cut her open. We're going to need this first. Boom. It's been a while since I've done an unboxing on here, honestly. I, uh, I was doing them all the time for a while, and then I kind of took a little break from doing the unboxings. And I think we're going to get back to doing them, man. I think it's time we, we do some cool unboxings on here. Uh, everybody likes to get, you know, cool stuff in the mail. Everyone likes to see some cool new products or whatever. Oh, man. I'm getting excited right now. I've already got a pretty good idea what this is. Actually, I'm not going to lie. I know exactly what this is. But you guys don't. And, uh... Oh, okay. I open it a little bit. This is really tight fit up here. This isn't, this isn't like an easy fit. This is... This is tight. Just toy it like a tiger. All right. You guys ready? I have a feeling when I open this, you'll see what it is, so... Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun. Oh, just a bunch of packaging. Yeah, just a whole bunch of packaging. Alright, let's find out what's in here. Throw all this stuff. Nobody wants all that. Get all that. Actually, I need to save all that stuff. And, right up front. Look at this here. A-Main. Yes. Alright. You guys know I love water bottles. I'm always walking around with a water bottle. Water bottles and coffee mugs. And, not only did I get one, two, I got three of them. So, you know what, maybe I'll wind up doing a giveaway on this. We'll see. I don't know. Or I might just give it to the homie. So, we'll see. We'll see. I might I might give one of these away to you guys. We'll find out here. Let's set those aside. Um, we'll set those right down here for now. Now, what's in this here? It's just like a shopping bag with something in it. Oh, snap, swag, we got swag. Look at that. Sunglasses. I love sunglasses. Amy and Hobby sunglasses. Yes, orange ones and white ones. Sweet. Let's see, how many white ones did we get? I think we only got one set of white ones. We got two sets of white ones, so I'm keeping the white ones. But I'm thinking we're going to do a giveaway and give away some of these orange ones here you guys give me a like in the car or give me a comment uh down there and let me know if you want to win some sunglasses in a giveaway maybe or maybe even a water bottle if you guys want to win one of these let me know put it in the comments and uh give me some ideas on what you'd be willing to do to win one i mean you know we've never done giveaways on here let's do some. let's have some fun with it that's gonna be awesome <clears throat> man a main is awesome dude they're already really really just making a great impression on me here now what is this Oh, I think this is shirts. All right. Now, I mean, given the fact that it's a new sponsor, I guess I do need to get swagged up so I can rock appropriately. This is a new shirt, ProTech RC shirt. Um, we got, what is this here? This is a new A-Main short sleeve tee. Navy. Awesome. Yeah, man. This is so sweet. Yes, white one. This is uh, A main, looks like a short sleeve, yep. Boom, cotton blend, or comfort blend. We've got another, is this another, yep, another short sleeve. Another navy blue, I like their colors too. The blue, white, and orange is pretty dope. I'm really digging that. Yeah, there's another one. And now I think that these little ones, that one's pretty little, I think that's for my wife, because I did let them know about my wife too, so. All right, you guys, we're in it, dude, we're in it. And one more, 
So let me throw those back in there actually because I don't want them to get dirty. My shop's real dirty. That is awesome. Now I can look official when I'm out and about. You guys know pretty much if you know me, if you see me around town, you will know that I pretty much only wear uh, RC clothes. I don't wear like normal clothes. I only wear sponsored clothes now pretty much. So when you see me out around town, I'm going to set these over here. Oh no, knocking stuff over. When you see me out and around town, I am usually wearing sponsored clothes of some kind. Like, no joke, dude. I enjoy the fact that I can actually live this type of a lifestyle where I can be relaxed like this. Oh, what? there's more down here. Oh, stickers. Oh, lots of stickers. Dang, yeah. Okay. That's cool. All right, so we're G'd up on stickers too. We might have to do a little sticker giveaway as well. Yeah, all right. We're gonna have some fun, I think, you guys. Yeah, so let me know in the comments. You want some stickers? You want some swag? You guys want some A-Main swag? Let me know, man. I think I might be able to make that happen. Now, here is the issue. How am I gonna get this out with one hand while I'm filming? Let me try this here. Oh, all right. I right, got that out. Let's get this box out the way. Let's set this back down. Oh, let's get this thing out of here. All right, there it is. Now yeah, let's look here. This is actually a pretty small box. I'm not gonna lie. I thought this box would be a little bit bigger than this. Um, void if damaged. Well, does that count? I don't know. We'll see. Oh no, that's pretty, pretty minor. There's a couple little puncture holes here. It looks like something hit it like that, maybe. Um, looks like a little corner hit right there. Nothing too crazy. So, let's go ahead and get this cracked open. Cut across the top. Cut the sides. Oh, all right, and I got a burger waiting for me when I get out too. So, you know, we'll leave it there for a minute. Let me, let's try this. It's kind of hard to hold the camera and do this. All right, so that's open. Let's lay this down here. You guys ready for this? Boom, pull that off. We've got a handle. So it looks like at least I opened the right side. Oh, shoot, you guys ready? Yeah! Oh! Oh! What is that? What is that? What is that? Yeah! You guys know what this is. You know what this is. Boom! Yeah! What you know about that, huh? That's what we're messing with today, guys. We got a Phantom 4. <laughs> yeah! Oh man, I am like beyond excited right now. I don't even know what to say. I am like... Ah, what do you guys, what do you even say to that? That is just epic. All right, so A-Main Hobbies, they wanted to be uh, helpful to me, you know, in the best way they could. And right now, I this is, in, this is a category I lack in. I don't have a drone. I don't have a way to show you guys aerial shots. I do event coverage. Could you imagine if I had this for the Axial Fest video? Oh, that would have been epic. So next year's Axial Fest video, now we can have aerial shots and actual quality ones so i am like i'm so stoked right now you guys i am so stoked let's uh i, I don't even know what to do let's look at the box i guess let's start here so we've got gps visual navigation three axis stabilized camera long range hd live view and 4k video recording oh man the box is super simple uh, it's got all kinds of cool stuff. I won't read all that. I'm sure you guys can read it all. Oh, over 26 minutes of flying time. Now, if you guys are like me, you will have already seen these on YouTube and probably might even have some friends that have them. I've got friends that have them. And uh, so I'm familiar with it. I've never flown a Phantom 4, but I've flown the bigger DJI, not the Inspire. I'm talking the Octocopter one uh, with a buddy of mine. I've helped him out doing some real estate filming and stuff so I'm familiar with him you know and I helped him uh, 
back when he was first getting into it, I was kind of, I had learned a little bit with him. So I am familiar with them. I just have never owned one. Let's get this out of here. Boom. All right, anything else in there? Nothing in there. Throw that away. And this is pretty nice. It's like a, feels like a foam case. Maybe not the whole case, I don't know. Maybe it is the whole case. It's definitely foam though, and this is how we open it, I guess. So, out with this. And then, turn it. Turn it this way. This has to be lifted up. Ah, so let's just take this off. All right. Oh, there it is. Oh man. Let me turn this sideways a little. Oh man, look at that. That is so sick. Oh, bro, I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm not saying anything intelligent right now. <laughs> I'm just, I need to get my fingers on that back there. I'm just so excited right now. There we go. There's the radio. And for those of you wondering what this is, this is to hold your phone or your uh, tablet, All right? So then, while you're flying, you can see. So me, I just picked up a new phone, actually. I'm pretty excited. I got this new Moto Z, which still has the stuff on it, even. So I will be using this, maybe, or I also have a little tablet. Maybe I could use that. Um, oh, man, I'm excited right now. Okay, so let's put this back in here. I don't want to mess nothing up yet. You guys know me, I'm rough on things. I gotta learn to be gentle with this. Let's put that back in there. And let's pull this out. Let's see it. Does it just lift right out? It does. Oh man, it makes me nervous. These things aren't cheap, you know. They're definitely not cheap. But they're definitely not junk either these are quality oh man now you guys are probably all wondering too with the new one that just came out because dgi just released the new uh i forget what it's even called but they just released their new uh foldable drone right well the mavic pro that's what it's called so with the mavic pro out right now um i could have went that route and got that little guy instead it's actually a little bit cheaper than this one um and it's way more convenient however it does not have a camera like this one. This one shoots amazing 4K. When you take the 4K from this and you put it side by side with the Mavic Pro 4K, you will see a clear difference. And uh, me, I, I'm not like Casey Nasdaq or whatever. I, I'm not willing to sacrifice my quality for convenience. You know, I want the quality. Um, and there's usually a way to get maximum quality without you know, being completely inconvenient. Now, yes, this is a little bit more inconvenient than folding some up and putting it in your pocket. However, we are talking about filming as a job here. So if you can't at least carry your tools with you and you just want to put it in your pocket, I mean, how well are you doing your job? I don't know. Anyways, just my opinion, I will take the quality over the convenience. So super stoked right now. Super, super stoked. Let's see, let's see, well, let's look and see what else is in here real quick. Just out of curiosity. Of course, we're going to have a book and everything, right? Little pamphlets and stuff. Little care package thing. Um, but what's in this over here? What's over here? We've got a nice case here. It's inside. Oh, there's our propellers. Okay. So there's our propellers right there. Slick. And you have to put those on and off every time. Like they click on and off, right? So, yeah, that's part of the convenience factor that everyone's talking about. With the new Mavic Pro, you don't have to take the propellers on and off. You can just fold it up. All right, so here's a cord here. I'm assuming this is for, like, a charging situation here. Yeah. So here's the charger. DJI set up here. Okay. Anything else down in there? No, oh, don't look like it. All right. So, really, that's not... There's not a lot to it. I mean, this is pretty, looks pretty, pretty straightforward. Let me make sure I get this back in here right. Um, I uh, I didn't really know what to expect because, like I said, I've never 
owned one. I just, and I've never unboxed one. I've never opened one up or nothing like this. But, uh, oh, how can I, there we go. But I have flown the, uh, bigger ones before with my buddy. And I've flown the smaller ones before as well when I worked in the hobby shop. So I'm kind of familiar. Kind of. That's, that's a. That's as far as I'm willing to go with that. I'm kind of familiar. Now let's see, can we get this back in? There's a very specific way this goes in here. Boom. There we have it. We're back in business. Alright, you guys. That is it. Oh, man. I am super stoked. Let's close this up. Make sure everything closes up properly. No issues. Boom. There we have it. DJI Phantom. Right here in the Extreme Scale Performance Shop. How cool is that, man? I'm super stoked. All right, you guys. You know what it is. Thank you for tuning in today. I'm going to see you on the trail or possibly in the air. You never know. Be sure to check out A-Main Hobbies. They really came through on this one. That's really, really awesome of them to really stand behind me and my passion for filming and help me get in the air. So can't thank you guys enough for coming through, man. That is really, really cool. You guys, go check out A-Main Hobbies. Link is in the description. Give them some love. Show them some support and see if they got something that you could use. I'm almost positive they got something you can use. Anyways, you know what it is. Peace and chicken grease. Yeah. All right.